This is the beginning of confident. Here we have an E flat. And then we have um, uh, uh, this is a G flat, right? Two, and then an A flat. Then B, B flat, right? It's not too hard to do, so try the first one. So we've got all four fingers when we play in the top four string. So I have third finger on the fourth fret of the D string. Second finger on the third fret of the G string. Third finger on the fourth fret of the B string. First finger on the second fret of the E string. My next one, my next chord, that's E flat, my next chord is going to be uh, this uh, G flat. I have third finger on the fourth fret of the D string. Second finger on the third fret of the G string. First finger on the second fret of both the B string and the E string. Now the exact same shape, I can move that up two frets like this, and that gets me to my A flat, right? So that is uh, third finger on the sixth fret of the D string. Uh, second finger on the fifth fret of the G string. First finger on the uh, fourth fret of the, of the uh, B and the E string, one of the two strings. Now we're going to play, um, that's a B right there, and so that is second finger on the fourth fret of the D string, third finger on the fourth fret of the G string, pinky finger on the fourth fret of the B string, and first finger on the second fret of the E string, and that's nice, that's my B, now I'm going to go to B flat, so all I have to do is move all four of those guys down here, one fret, that takes me to Second finger on the third fret, second finger on the third fret of the D string, third finger on the third fret of the G string, pinky finger on the third fret of the B string, and first finger on the first fret of the E string. So all told, I have this. So that's not too hard, and that's pretty much the whole set of changes in uh, confidence.